Hello photographers. What are some of the more important points to consider for good wildlife photography? It's not as complicated as some might think. For me, it's not about the big Mondo 600 millimeter lens. It's not about hiking off into some uncharted wilderness for days on end. Although I'm sure there's some good photography out there. There are two things that are pretty important and they're kind of related. Patience and moving slowly. And what I mean by that is, when you're out walking the trail, don't go blasting out there like you really got someplace to go, like you're late for work. Take your time. Slow down, be observant. And if you do see wildlife, slowly bring the camera to your eye. Don't go whipping it up there looking, you know, thinking you're going to get the shot. If you think you need to get closer to the wildlife, slow, deliberate steps. Don't go rushing over there. I can't tell you the number of times in my past where I was just sitting there and let's say a bird that I've never seen before lands over here. And my excitement, I'm like, oh my god, I gotta get the shot. Gone. I cringe every time I think of those missed opportunities. These days, I will lie flat on my stomach, army crawl, inch by inch, in the mud, just to get close enough to photograph a toad. I am in no rush, and neither should you be. All the most impressive equipment in the world, running off to the far corners of the earth, it'll do you no good if you're impatient and you let your excitement get the better of you. So, the keys to good wildlife photography, be patient, take your time. Good photographs will come of it. And oh yeah, if you do have a 600mm lens, that's a pretty good deal too. <laughs>